Hey there everybody, Aaron here, and welcome to the new season, or main, maybe I should say the main series, for Mage Quest. So I did do a smaller series of this, um, I have it marked as season 1 I think right now. I may change that to just, uh, it ended up being more of a look at the, the mod pack than actually really legit playing the mod pack. What is over there? Oh, a village. We has a village. Um, and I had planned on coming back to this series at some point, this mod pack, but I thought I'd be longer, a longer period of time. Now, the reason why that didn't end up working out that way is because I spent time, and if you've watched the update video, this won't be news to you, but the channel update video I did, but I spent time recording a different series entirely, and ultimately decided I didn't like it. Uh, at all and so I decided I wasn't gonna release it and that was for a different mod pack and maybe I'll talk about that at some point uh, the mod pack itself was fairly fun but the, the overall series and the way I did things I didn't like and so instead of recording that series with that mod pack again I decided I was going to just come back to mage quest because I enjoyed playing this mod pack a lot and we're going to do uh, take this slowly, more like I would a normal series. I don't have any of the pre-starting stuff. Uh, past, I picked up the uh, the starter chest, because I like to use that a lot. Um, but otherwise, that's that's all I have. As you can see, I don't, I don't have a base or anything established yet. This is a huge village looking at the minimap. So that's what this is. Uh, hopefully... You guys will enjoy this. I know that I originally said I was going to pull to see what the major and minor magics were going to be. I decided that uh, since I ended up accelerating this and doing this series sooner than I thought, um, I just picked what we're going to do, and we'll see that in a minute. It is going in. Blah, 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 blah. It is going to be different than what we did in the other version, so. There is a lot of coal here. You know it would have been smart to actually like grab more lumber than I did. Since we have it, we will do this. Um, so today we need to kind of get things started. We need we have a lot of stuff we have to do. Uh, it's pretty much all the same norm the normal. Stuff you would expect. But let's get cracking. I will pick the magics before the end of this episode as well, but I figure since it's daylight, let's try and get some stuff grabbed here. Especially since we have found a ridiculous amount of coal. Uh, this series I do plan on taking... Uh, I kind of mentioned this is going to be a slower version. This is going to be more like a normal, normal run series for me. We're going to take things at my my pace but I'll show you guys pretty much everything that happens instead of uh, setting up a bunch of pre-done stuff or doing a ton off camera uh, at least to begin with I'll show you everything as as the series progresses and you've seen some of this stuff then I might start doing some of it off off screen but for now and the day this episode is coming out I have a job interview that morning, so I wish me luck on that. And if that works out well, my channel stuff will probably become closer to what it normally was. I kind of mentioned this in the update video that I put out the other day. So that's my hope, because that would be nice. There really is like a ridiculous amount of coal right here. Okay, I see we got some chickens over there. Man, there's even more coal over here. So the world seed for this seed, I believe, is Cadgar, which is a mage from World of Warcraft. So. Again, I used a mage-based seed name for a seed, world seed. Um, 
So if you're interested in playing on this exact world seed, there you go. If you just look up online how to spell it, you will figure it out fairly easily. Wonder if there's any food in this village that we can steal. Should see if there's a blacksmith here too. Since we found a village right away, we'll probably I think what we'll do here is I'll try to I think I'll set up the base somewhere near here to some extent, because having access to a easy access to a village is probably pretty useful. And that rarely happens for me to start uh, with a village kind of right here. What is that village you're fighting? A baby zombie it looks like. Ouch. We saved that villager's life! You have been saved, villager! Bookshells. That actually could be useful if we had emeralds. Okay. Let's uh, rob the blacksmith here. Oh, this isn't the blacksmith. This is one of those libra uh, library or whatever. I guess we'll take all of this stuff. A Doom Scholar's account of dis discourse with the undead. Okay. I would imagine in a, a town this big though, why is there an emerald sitting there? We need to get into this house. There is an emerald that was... So are you like just chucking emeralds out here or something, dude? Because I'll take them. I don't know if any of these uh, this these mods in this pack like do anything crazy to villagers. Or not. So... See an actual oh this place is huge. There's a whole section over here we haven't even seen yet. Bookshelves in there. Okay. <laughs> I didn't see an actual forge here though. That kinda stinks. Those are great to find early on, of course. Of course you probably know that, as I imagine those watching this are somewhat familiar with Minecraft. Well darn, that kinda stinks. What the heck? Gold coins. For books, interesting. Well, that's a use for coins, I guess. And now it's gonna become nighttime. And we really don't have a bed or anything. I wonder which way should we go? Well, that way is forested. Maybe we'll walk that way and see what happens. Let's see, what do I have on a break? On. Let's turn. We'll turn that all the way up. That should help with the dark. Try and fix that problem from last series. Since we're gonna wander around at night anyway, which is a dumb idea to begin with. But hey, I'm not the most intelligent guy. We really probably should try and grab all this iron that's sitting here. Come back! You know, I've, I've we saw these plenty when we were playing in the last series, and I never did really bother to mess with these things, but...
they do have pretty good resources within them. Whoa! I lagged and about fell. That would have been fun. Grab what iron we can here. Oh, it's interesting. Creepers hanging out already, not surprisingly. There's some lava that way. What do we end up with for iron? 21, that's not bad to start. Well, we don't want to wander too far from the village. You know what? I actually should go back and we can put a waypoint down in the village and at least depend no matter where I'm at we can I can find my way back here so let's uh let's do that can we actually get in one of the houses maybe That was weird. I'm not sure what that was. Well, there goes a bunch of stuff. We'll take it. It's ours now. More creepers, really? Oh, yeah, I did it. Okay, let's see. How do you do this again? I've messed with a couple different of these now. A uh, new one! Village! One! <laughs> okay, so we have the village. And plenty of evil creatures here trying to kill everybody. You know what, I suppose this is a good time to do this as any. Let's pull out the quest book real quick. Mage quest, we have read this already. Initiation! We need to pick up the stuff. Absent teachers. So we need to... Okay, we did all that stuff. Why did that go all the way back? Oh, I hit the wrong button, that's why. Oh, we need to kill a cow. I forgot about that. There are cattle over here. So we'll. Oh, there is a node there. There's a cow. Die, spider! Take your stuff and make a bow. Oh, we got a skeleton. Got an Enderman. We got an Enderman and a skeleton. We want that stuff now. Run away! Run, dang it! Jeez. Why are you hanging out outside? It's okay, I'll just hang out out here for a while. Hmm. <laughs> okay, we got that one done. The joy of teaching us how to do things. The science of magic, wit in witchery, magic within, and natural power. 
So we're gonna do witchery as our main thing this one. One of the oldest paths of magic, witchery draws power from the number of sources, plants, animals, and even other planes of existence. Witches channel this power to help with the help of seemingly mundane tools to create a wide range of possible results, from protection to transmutation of plants and animal life, to summoning of beings from other realms. I don't know what that means. But we need to find these seeds. So we need Belladonna, Mandrake, Water Artichoke, and Snowbell. And we could use for it to not be nighttime. That would be nice too. Oh lordy, that's a lot of creepers. Come on. There we go. Hey, there's a book. Woo! That was fun. That was also an epic fail on my part, but... Oh well. We will steal the dirt. What book was that? Lightning Storm! Interesting. Okay, we don't need some of this junk. Enrollment application, oh yeah. Gotta make sure I don't consume any extra paper that we didn't want to get rid of in this, this time around either. I think we are going to head that way. It should be getting to be daylight soon, I would think. Kaboom. Okay, that's one of them that we need. Snowbell. Mandrake. Zombie. Zombie. Let's see, we kind of need to establish a base here a little bit. Let's see if we can find some place interesting to set up shop. We can at least get back to that village if we need to. I was kind of hoping we'd find like a magical forest or something here not too far away since those are supposed to be extremely useful. Some ruins there. I haven't decided on the secondary profession quite yet. Uh, secondary magic thing. I'll pick that when we get to that point. But we need to we need somewhere to set up shop. I'm not sure if we shouldn't stay near a shore or something though. To be honest. Decisions, decisions. I kind of hate the fact that the eagles in this uh, mod sound like chickens. Uh, 
it looks like we're getting into snowy stuff now. Okay, what did we find here? Oh, did we find a mausoleum? I think we did. Yep. And the zombies can't get out because they are stuck. Okay, we will, you know what, I will... New waypoint! We'll come back to this when I have... Uh... Um, once we establish a base and can actually carry more loot, loot with us. Take advantage of these waypoints. There's probably a shortcut, I guess, to add those. I didn't really think about it. Pumpkins. Found a craft spot, looks like. Altar. I don't know, maybe we'll go up here. We're kind of near, we're kind of in a good spot as far as uh, the biomes go, because we can kind of get access to about anything. So maybe we'll make this hilltop our base. We got a swamp over there, maybe. But I feel like this is a good spot, so I think this is where we'll, uh, we'll call home. And with that, I think I'm probably going to end this episode. It might be a little short. I am not sure where we're at. But next episode, we will be able to take some time and work on obtaining some of this other stuff that we need to get done. And we'll take some time and actually... We'll start working on the base itself. I think we're going to level some of this out and we'll build a house. We can build a way to get down to the shore and we can probably build a dock down there. That might be kind of neat, right? So that's going to do it for this, everybody. Hopefully you are enjoying this episode. Hopefully you enjoy this version of the series. We're going to take it slower, try and have more fun, explore more of the mods in general. Uh, the only thing I have to ask is forgive me if I am a little bit of a putz with this mod pack because I've learned some stuff about it, but I'm still not very good with the magic stuff in general. So it is what it is. Hopefully you enjoy it all the same. But that's going to do it for me today, everybody. As always, take care of yourselves, and I will see you guys on the next episode. Bye bye